To begin, place your Castle Flex on the floor. Place your heel in the heel strap. Make sure that the heel strap is around your heel bone and not up on your Achilles where it is soft and tender. So keep it low. Second toe goes on that flex line. And then roll back to start the lower body stretches. Leg goes flat to the floor. Opposite leg is flat as well, or it can be bended. And you want to make sure your arms are straight. Chest out, shoulders back. And you're almost pushing your palms to the floor to get the toe dorsiflexion. So Carly's gonna roll up. As her leg goes up the pendulum, she wants to do about 20 to 30 seconds for every 10 degrees. So every 10 degrees that she moves up, she's just gonna roll the fabric up, making sure that her neck is relaxed and her shoulders are back and her chest is out and she's tracking her stretches with her eyes. Now, if she wants to switch to underhand grip at 45 degrees, she can, that will activate her biceps. And when she wants to go into isolated hamstring stretch, she's going to reach her hands to the ceiling and she's going to pull back keeping her arms straight. The second thing I always think about is where my bar is located. Make sure you're always pushing the bar down toward your hips and almost touching your thigh. This will help your toes be in complete dorsiflexion. Always double check where your heel strap is located. Make sure it's not touching your Achilles. That's that soft, tender spot. Make sure the strap is low down, almost touching the floor on that heel bone. 